jamais souffrir de nouveau. Good evening, everybody. Welcome to the Science Gallery. Coco Chanel once said, fashion is not something that exists in dresses only. Fashion is in the sky, in the street. Fashion has to do with ideas, the way we live, what is happening. In many ways, exactly the same thing could be said of science. It's not something that exists only in remote and mysterious laboratories, but something that infiltrates our lives. This is electric skin. It's a, a bioresponsive wearable that turns the breath of the wearer into pulses of light in the garment. How fashion has kind of been viewed as very materialistic, it's now being shown as something extremely scientific, extremely thought-provoking, and also extremely relevant in the sociological context as well. What happens when nanotechnologists meet fashion designers? Will biotechnology enable us to grow a second skin? Technothreads aims to open up these questions to passionate discussion and debate. One of the, the elements in curating this exhibition that really came home to me in, in speaking to the individual designers and exhibitors here was how, how strong the mutual respect is between science and fashion. <laughs> I am more Agmaier Scott. And I am Joe de Kopp. And uh, we designed the We, we designed Techno Threads. Uh, it's meant to feel, actually it's not meant to be feel futuristic, it's meant to feel immersive. Fashion is about sort of you and yourself and looking at yourself, so that's why I've got lots of reflective surfaces. We designed the, uh, the whole brand of the show, which is the big, you know, the blindfold. And that seems people have really responded to that, and it has lots of different connotations, blindfolds, you know. So, you know, there's a bit of S and M and all sorts of things. And it's a bit like not looking at things, and if you don't know what's going to happen next, do you this sort of thing? So. Uh, my favourite part is the exhibition upstairs. It has the fermented dress, the fermented Guinness dress, and the wine dress, and the. Um, the jackets, the cell culture, little jackets are uh, growing because my uh, my initial reaction when I heard about that was this whole definition of what is life and so these are, are these alive or not alive and I think it could spark an interesting debate. They're ceremonial, they're ceremonial conflict suits like you can act out your aggression but without violence. dresses using bacteria uh, with wine. So they eat the wine and uh, produce this sort of a, a skin which we then make into, into dresses. But the, the special thing we've done for this exhibition is that we've also made an outfit out of Guinness. I will say that when the bacteria prefer red wine to Guinness. Well, it's good because it leaves us more Guinness. <laughs> <laughs> 